Hello, Mioni here, and welcome back to another video for Final Fantasy XIV. This time, we're going to be making a glamour in the style of an NPC. Yes, we're going to be recreating an NPC's glamour. Last time around, we looked at a main character from Shadowbringers, Chai Nuz. This time, we're going to be looking at a side character. You've probably walked past this NPC hundreds of times, and you've probably even talked to her in the past as well. This is none other than Hillison. Now, in particular, you might be uh, familiar with Hillison, considering she has the ability to upgrade 450 crafted pieces to 460 item level. If this is something you weren't familiar with, and you've been running around with 450 gear, then this is a little side tip for you to go and exchange that stuff, and you can get some decent items out of it. Anyway, Hillison is always one of the few high ears in Yormor that catches my eye every time, and the particular reason for that is those beautiful tights working well with that chest piece. So what gear is she wearing? That's why you're here, that's why I'm creating this video, and as a side note, we'll be looking at lots of other NPCs, main and side again, in the future in these videos. But let's see what exactly she is wearing. So it took me no time at all, really, to figure out the basis for this set. There was a few little bits I had to zoom in on and sort of compare but the chest piece is definitely the Plague Bringer's coat. This is a caster specific outfit off of the last boss of Belladonna inside St. Mossy's Arboretum normal mode. Now, apparently, you can also get this chest piece from Pharos Sirius Hard off of the last boss in there as well. But I believe that St. Mossianis is probably faster to unsync as you just burn through all of those insects. And you can actually skip a section of that fight as well by just destroying the doors and sliding down the thing you can skip entire trash packs so it makes it a lot faster than if you were to run Baros Sirius hard which has lots of gateways that require you to kill mobs before they drop so that was a particularly difficult thing to farm it's got a very low drop chance it just seems to give me the melee outfits all the time or some trousers the loot pool is massive but yes that plague bringer's coat is definitely what we're going for for this chest. It is unfortunately undiable, as you might know, but we're just recreating the NPC. We're not after we're not after actually changing this stuff. So for the hands, I had to zoom in on this bit. This was a bit that tasked me the most. I believe these are the claws of the beast. You can get these from the gold saucer. And these are dyed metallic gold. So clearly Hillison likes those gold claws there. These will cost you 30,000 MGP from the prize claim vendor one over in the gold saucer. Now, 30k MGP isn't actually that much considering you get 60k a week just from Fashion Report. So if you're short on MGP, be sure to watch those videos. And that's my shameless plug for Friday's videos out the way. Next up, we have the Evenstar tights and the Evenstar booties. I believe these are the weathered versions of them, or at least they're the ones we're going to go for ourselves because the booties actually cost 30 allied seals and the legs cost 40 allied seals. Now, allied seals are very easy to get. You can get these if you have a blue mage just simply by doing some of the blue mage logs incentives as you can see on screen now they reward absolutely tons of these so yeah it's not particularly difficult to get our allied seals these days so if you do want to get some really cool glamour and um, you know some past job gear then you can totally go and do that and you can go to any of the three hunt bill masters which are located in Uldar, New Gradania and Limbs and Luminsa upper decks at the Arf Castle at each of those three grand company areas and you can go and grab these for, like I say, 40 allied seals for the legs and 30 for the boots. And that's pretty much what Hillison is wearing. She doesn't seem to have a weapon equipped, not one that we can physically see. But she is a caster and this is a casting set. I just I just personally love the way that that outfit goes together. It's like the Evenstar stuff was designed to go with a Plaguebringer set. I've always been a fan of the Plaguebringer stuff especially the mask usually but yeah this is definitely a set that was on my list of things i wanted to replicate clearly hillison herself is a generic hire but we make it look 10 times better being a makote i think you'll agree if there's any npc that stands out to you feel free to leave a comment below and i might just check them out in a future recreation video thank you kindly for watching and i'll see you all next time